Today is day one of the statewide stay-at-home order. Here in Hawaii, we're an island. We have finite resources. So gotta cook what get. And soon we had a small contingent of, you know, of, of thinkers. And very quickly, we were fortunate that we partnered with both Aloha Harvest, the Pacific Gateway. Um, we also reached out to the Hawaii Food Bank, who graciously offered their services. And we right now we're over here in Kalihi, on the island of Oahu, at the Pacific Gateway Center. Uh, PGC is our hub, where our organization, Chef Hui, we aggregate ingredients and food. We have some food production going on as well. And then we take all of this and then we send it out to communities that need it best. And you remember like, oh, can I see my grandma? But I, I'm eating this beef stew and it tastes like hers. Then it's like, it connects somehow, you know? No more potato, ulu, sweet potato, kalo. If you don't have any of that, you don't yes. even gotta put that either. Cooking is all about using what's around us. Let's get around the group. We continue to be creative and try and stretch our dollar as far as we can. And the give and go program is a good example of that when we're giving a stipend to a restaurant who's committed to buying local food from our local farmers and those are turning into community meals. We feel really good about that dollar going as far as we could take that one donation from folks. First at six, it's the first time Hawaii has recorded triple digit increase in new COVID-19 cases. The new cases come as the state considers imposing new restrictions on bars or closing them entirely and limiting the size of gatherings. That Hawaii, we, we rise, you know, we rise to the challenge uh, and it happens every single day, but COVID definitely brought that out into, into the large light. Hunger, hunger doesn't care how much money you make. Hunger doesn't care what kind of car you drive. Hunger affects all of us. So, you know, show that aloha. Thanks for coming. Yeah, right on you guys. Cheering gang.